I am uh, Manjunath uh, Joshi and uh, I am serving as uh, Dean R&D at DICT Gandhinagar. Uh, here I'll uh, give you a brief uh, intro to what is uh, artificial intelligence, what is data science, what is machine learning, etc. which are very popular uh, fields uh, these days. Artificial intelligence uh, refers to a broader area is a theory uh, that uh, is used in developing uh, the artificial systems such as the computers that can do the job of uh, what a human being can do for example uh, uh, one can uh, a human being can differentiate between uh, the cat and a dog whether this can be done when a photo is shown to a computer yes that can be done a human being can translate one language into another language yes it can be done by the computer so artificial intelligence is a broader area which can do such tasks as done by the human beings now as far as the data science is concerned both data science and the machine learning or sub branches of this uh, broader area uh, artificial intelligence so data science uh, refers to the study of uh, scientific approaches extract some meaningful meaningful information from the data now the machine learning as such is a learning technique machine learning corresponds to learning techniques that develop uh, the algorithms to learn uh, from the data Uh, in case of uh, the uh, data science uh, we concentrate more on uh, data visualization and better representation of the data while in the case of machine learning we try to use a large amount of data and using this data we try to learn a function that fits this data better there are numerous applications of uh, these uh, areas Uh, for example uh, when you receive a mail in your uh, gmail these mails are automatically transferred uh, to different folders for example the inbox uh, social then promotion spam etc uh, this is done by machine learning algorithms self driving cars they also use the concept of uh, these uh, areas uh, which we have uh, discussed Uh, different institutions are offering courses uh, in these areas however there is a need for such courses which can combine the theoretical concepts with the practical applications in order to make it uh, very interesting dict being one of the premier institutions uh, is also offering courses uh, in these areas at uh, DICT train the students to develop uh, the critical thinking skills and also to understand uh, the relevant concepts in uh, uh, certain courses such as uh, linear algebra probability and statistics uh, optimization theory etc so we uh, not only give the uh, theoretical concepts to the students also the uh, concepts that are covered in the class are illustrated or they are demonstrated by uh, lab experiments using the data which is practically available which is an advantage for the students to uh, gain better understanding of the uh, concepts in these areas so i feel that uh, the dict is a right choice for uh, learning these uh, courses